Ole Miss scientist Marco Cavaglia blends in well with the children viewing a recent exhibit on the LIGO collaboration. I'm really surprised, uh, positively surprised by these kids because they are really bright and uh, I hope that in the future one of them will decide to become a scientist. Cavaglia is a principal investigator on the University of Mississippi's LIGO team, a group that includes more than 600 people from universities around the world. The team works to detect gravitational waves from the spiral and merger of binary compact stars and black holes. Sometimes it's a bit frustrating because uh, uh, you can't really explain uh, to uh, people who are not in the field what, what you are doing, but it's also very, I mean, it's very interesting and challenging. So in an effort to explain what they do, an exhibit was created. Funded in part by the National Science Foundation, the traveling exhibit has hands-on activities that help explain the complex research involved in the LIGO experiment. We have uh, uh, the space-time membrane, so uh, kids and people can play around and see what is the effect of the curvatures of, of the space. Or we have the Black Hole Hunter game. It seems to be very popular. Uh, in New York, uh, uh, a couple of months ago, we, we had the exhibit at the World Science Festival, and there were kids lying up uh, and trying to play it. So simply, it really uh, uh, hits their imagination. I like learning about black holes. I've always wanted to learn about black holes. The exhibit will be on display in several universities in the South, including Russ College and Arkansas State University.